Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel with me, Hannes here. In this video, I would like to share my own experience or story about how German culture took me into a very different person than before. As an Indonesian, I made this video because I'm so grateful for my current self, which I think has changed into someone better than before. For my friends or those of you who are watching this because you are planning to live in Germany and still had no experience of living in this country, I hope this video can be useful for you to receive the culture shock that you might get when you arrive in Germany. Alright everyone, let's get started. First, become more talkative. Before I moved to Germany, I was kind of a very different person than who was very carefully when speaking. That is because I didn't want to hurt somebody's feeling, including my parents, family or friends, especially somebody at work. As someone who has experience working in Indonesia, you cannot say anything to your colleagues at work just to maintain a good relationship with them, even though they annoy you. Well, sometimes you have to keep them to yourself. Or sometimes a lot of people pretending like nothing is wrong. And especially when there was an argument, I prefer to choose carefully what kind of words I should say in the first place or sometimes not express entirely what was in my mind even though there was a bunch of things that I really wanted to say from my mind. A lot of people in my country pretending that nothing was wrong even though that somebody hurt them, even though they feel bad about something. They only keeping it by themselves. This is Indonesian culture actually and that is almost entirely like this, especially in the workplace, to parents or friends and others. It's so difficult to have openness because there is a fear of hurting somebody's feeling. Even though I've had experience of living in Canada and the UK for a little while, based on what I observe, they still have the same place and tries in their daily communication. So in terms of communication, when I was in Canada and the UK, in my experience, I still had no problems at all. But after I moved to Germany, it really changed me to 360 degrees. As you know, German culture is one of the culture that is known for being straightforward. I think this culture put me in a better direction by being confident that as long as you're right, you have the right to open up without, without having to be afraid of hurting anyone else. I truly love how I can say whatever is on my mind now without feeling guilty and as long as you say it or I say it clearly and friendly without beating around the bush and it's okay. Many of my friends have the same experience as me that when they flew back to Indonesia from Germany, their family asked them why they have become more chatty than before, detailed about more things and being more critical in so many ways. Well, actually that is how the way you live in Germany. Second is privacy. Well, mostly in Indonesia, it's so difficult for people to respect somebody's privacy or maybe because it's so common every day that it doesn't feel at all that your privacy has actually been interfered by others. For example is, when I was at school, there was many of my friends who sometimes asked to see my mobile phone because it was a common thing, so I didn't realize that I gave my privacy to them or others. After I moved to Germany, I learned a lot about privacy. And this really changed me back to 360 degrees. I realized this when I come back to Indonesia from Germany and I got a friend who visited me at that time, but she immediately opened my iPad without my permission. And honestly, that moment really made me surprised, which, me, which made me thinking, what is wrong actually with this person who don't respect somebody's privacy by getting into someone's gadget? And about how she behaved like that, I truly didn't feel comfortable and feel weird. It really made me delusion and upset until finally I thought that she didn't have a good attitude visiting somebody's homes, even though it was a friend. And I think a friend is a friend and no matter what, do not ever try to violate somebody's privacy. I wonder if I was overreacting until I started discussing it about, about this to my husband and he taught me that it was not normal actually. Moreover, there are my bank accounts there and all the password and other my financial stuff. That's why my husband and I thinking if somebody has this trade, it's so dangerous for the people, for the people who might know your bank password and all the other confidently that other people shouldn't know. So yeah, for the time being, that is what German culture has changed me so far and I know it's not much but I think it's a huge positive change that I truly love. Well, I don't know how the way you guys gonna enjoy all the things you're gonna get when you move to Germany or probably when you move to another country. But honestly, for me, I truly loved it. I truly enjoyed it. Even thought that in the end of the day, when I return to my homeland in Indonesia, there will be a lot of difference and even incompatibility between me and my old friends in Indonesia cause already has a different view of life. But I think it's normal because every human being has their own change, whether it's for the better or for the worse. And of course, you have to choose your sequel which is good for you. 
Alright everyone, before I say goodbye, I hope you got a like and subscribe. Don't forget to comment below because I'm gonna share my other interesting experience with you. Alright, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.